Hi, this is Seb from Wirebox. In this video, I'd like to show you how we can easily emboss text onto a round object, in this case, cylinder. So we've got our cylinder on the scene. Uh, let's add the text, Shift A, add text, and then rotate it 90 degree on the X axis, so air ax 90. Now let's switch to front view, one on the numpad, and we can edit the text. Tap on your keyboard and you can write whatever you like. I'm gonna put simple text. Let's scale down the text a bit and we can scale up the cylinder. We're gonna project the text onto the cylinder. So the best uh, if the text is not wider than the cylinder. And now before we apply our first modifier, we have to convert the text into the mesh. So we can go to object menu, then convert and click to mesh. Now when you switch to edit mode, you will see that the text geometry is not very good. We have to change it by adding our first modifier. So let's click add modifier, then generate, and we choose decimate. So what the decimate modifier do, basically it reduces the number of vertex and it keep roughly the same shape, so it doesn't change the shape much. So in the decimate box, we have to change to planar and tick apply. And now when you switch to edit mode, you will see that our text got less vertices. And now we can add another modifier to our mesh text. This time, instead of generate, you have to choose deform and then shrink wrap modifier. And then we have to change the wrap method from the near surface point to project. Then under the target, we have to grab eyedropper and choose cylinder. And nothing happened yet because we have to change from positive to negative. Now you see our text wrapped around the cylinder. So let's apply the modifier. So now faces of our text are completely flat, the same as the um, faces of cylinder. Let's apply some thickness to the text. To do this we have to add another modifier, generate and this time choose solidify. And here we can adjust thickness as well as offset. And if we're happy with our text, let's apply the modifier. And now everything looks good, but we've got two objects, cylinder and text. We need to join them together, so after this we've got one object, a cylinder with embossed text on it. To do this we have to apply another modifier, but this time to the cylinder. Let's select the cylinder, add modifier, generate, and this time boolean modifier. In the boolean panel we have to switch from difference to union, and under the object grab the eyedropper and choose text. And now we can apply our modifier. And now we've got one more issue to solve. Uh, as you see on the text, you, you see the uh, gray faces. This is our original text that is still there. We have to delete it. So go to scene collection, click text, then X to delete and delete the text. And that's it in this video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel and see you next time. Bye.